वन टू वन कूल गूगल स्वैक्स इंक्लूडिंग द कूल लाइट लैम्प गिम्बल एक्सेट्रा एंड अपॉर्चुनिटी टू लीड द कम्युनिटी एंड बेसिकली विन कूल स्वैक्स एंड सर्टिफिकेट्स ऑफिशियली एंड बी अ पार्ट ऑफ गूगल क्लाउड फैसिलिटेटर टीम सो हेयर इज अपॉर्चुनिटी विच विल बी स्टार्टिंग सून सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट हाउ यू कैन बिकम अ फैसिलिटेटर एंड लीड योर स्टूडेंट्स एंड बेसिकली विन कूल स्वैक्स एंड सर्टिफिकेट्स ऑफिशियली फ्रॉम गूगल टीम टू सो बिफोर यू स्टार्ट make sure you are subscribed to the channel and do hype the video too so basically first of all let me tell you yesterday i posted a video regarding the claim of claim your swags now google cloud arcade facilitator okay so here i have already mentioned the facilitator swags not facilitator program swags so basically it's only for facilitators now you may be thinking how we can become a facilitator too so here this video is perfectly for you so here first of all let me brief you about the arcade facilitator program basically it is just like a arcade program where we earn some badges but here in exchange of it we get some cool rewards like here here in the facilitator program and in the arcade program a major difference is that in arcade program we get the swags but in the facilitator program only the facilitators receive the swags not the students basically if you have joined under any code or referral code then you will not getting the swags so whatever swags which you have seen if i show you i haven't added the facilitator swags if i have the videos and if it is available over here wait a second Why it's not working? Let me see. So if you are able to basically here you can see clearly that these are the facilitator swags. Like you can see in previously we had cool gimbals, uh, basically water bottle and basically cool light also. You can see the gimbal is also here. If you want to see the video, you can just ask me or just check the playlist section or I will add it all the things in the description too. So basically. facilitators are those people who help you to complete the program like assisting with the lab solutions lab guides how to claim the credits all the things they take care of you for the entire two month basically the facilitator program is for two month and as a participant if you are participated as a participant then also you can become a facilitator we'll be talking about it in the this video only so basically for the participants basically who are joining under any facilitator will be getting bonus point but the facilitator who is joining under basically the joining not basically who is becoming a facilitator will be getting limited edition cool swags and certificates you can see like this swags we get and multiple swags are also there i will just share all the swags which i have received from the facilitator team by my friends and i will share all the things do not worry about it so basically here in the facilitator program what is your job as i said facilitator basically helps the participants you have to suppose if you are a college student and you have a big community so basically you can introduce about the cloud concept through your juniors here basically you learn about new cloud skills like computing application development big ai data ml and if you are just basically completing the jni agent course there also we have to deploy our agent so you can learn about the ai agents basically the working with data flow jobs whatever multiple things are there cloud storage etc and here you earn basically points and which you can use for redeeming the swags but as a facilitator you are not redeeming the swags basically you are helping people to redeem the swags in the arcade program in short if you want to just summarize the what is arcade facilitator program is basically you are just uh, helping as a instructor or guide to help your students so here the form for the arcade facilitator cohort 2 is already live if you want to know how you can fill the form let's cover it in this video only so here is the interest form you can clearly see so this is the interest form for the cohort 1 which will be starting in january 2026 so you can just start filling the form here basically you have to enter your email address so basically enter your email address here you have to take care of multiple things which i will tell you so click on i accept and just click on next now once you have click on next here you have to enter your full name full name does not mean you can write anything okay you have to write full name which is printed on your government id basically on your driving license aadhar card and voter id second important thing is that you have to confirm your email again basically make sure there is no typo in the email and third 
third thing is that name of the institution or organization whether you are just self employed or if you are uh, basically studying in college you can mention the college name or organization if you want to mention your company and basically if you don't want to mention you can just write n slash a so if i come over here so let me just show you a test email So here you have to enter the institution name or your college name and whether you are a student working developer and other like you are from different background like you are from life science etc or basically you are from arts background you can mention it uh, basically they are asking for just normal data it won't be used anywhere so you can just mention anything there is no issue and this arcade facilitator program which we are seeing you can mention your country and then linkedin profile okay linkedin profile you have to make sure to make it because th this time they ask for the linkedin profile it's very easy you have to come to the linkedin website like if i show over here so here is the linkedin website you have to simply sign up login and just enter your details and then you have to enter your profile url now here you have to mention the youtube channel now many of you are confused that we don't have a youtube channel do we need to be a big youtuber or even a small youtuber big and small does not matter but do we need to become a youtuber for just beating getting selected so the answer is no even if you don't become a youtuber like many of the my connection facilitators were not a youtuber but they shared my videos with their participants to complete the badges so yes if you are not a youtuber you can just type in a and then simply okay then simply you have to just enter your cloud community profile over here on the next thing so do not worry if you don't have the youtube channel if you become a facilitator you can share my share my basically what we can say uh, YouTube channel okay now here is the developer profile and here you have to mention your Google Cloud community profile okay so for that you have to come over here and basically you can see here where is the my post so if I come over here to the my post section and if I remove over here this activity okay so if I come over here and here is my URL okay you can clearly see this is my URL so you have to clearly see your username is clearly visible now here you have to paste it and just you have to just make sure that you are having a working internet connection okay working internet connection that basically a laptop and a working connection is required but even if you don't have a laptop i think it will work there is no issue for completing the badge you need only a one day you can complete in your college or ask for any friends also now here we have to just share our public profile so public profile basically if you are completely new and you have you are you are having no knowledge about the google cloud skills so basically first of all let me sign up and let me show you so this is how you have to come to the skills.google website and after that you have to just click on join now when you click on join it will ask two option sign in with google okay or create with account with google then it will select the google account which is signed in into your basically in the laptop desktop or mobile or if you want to just use the traditional method first name last name in company you can write na and password and make sure very important thing is date of birth is genuine okay now you hear your date date of birth should be a legally valid like you are 18 plus and make sure to use it officially uh, date of birth like original date of birth okay now second thing you have to just after you sign in if i show you the sign in process once you sign in over here or even if you create the account okay it will look like this you will be redirected particularly to this dashboard now to activate your public profile you have to come over here and click on the settings option after you click on the settings option you can see my profile is visible over here but if i let me see if their badge is yes there is no badge so no issue so i can just show you a quick demo also so now here what we need to do by default the public profile will be not public okay so you have to just click on it and just click on update settings now you can see the public profile is successfully activated you have to right click copy the link address and simply paste the url over here okay now here 
after you fill this and then you have to just select this 55 five, and then why you think that, that you are the right person for becoming the facilitator basically you have to tell them why you think you are the right person why they should select you so the answer you have to just answer it you can take help from basically normal AI but do not copy paste and if you know you have conducted basically any events in your college campus in previous years basically if you are working professional also then also you can become a facilitator so here while basically you have to mention that why you are the right person basically if you have hosted any community events you can share your experience that i will help you to basically help people to learn about cloud computing via genuine methods and we will just build a new community i have contributed in any hackathon we have used basically google cloud project and then you have to just make them basically here you have to tell them the quality why you think you are the right person so you can do it very easily and if you have ever led any events in the college okay like if you have led any hackathons hosted any hackathons or any basically programs we have multiple programs in our colleges also so you can just share your experience like you can just make a condition artificial condition like you're working with apis or basically working with cloud functions or cloud pubs up you can try to integrate the google clouds things also or even if you are not able to you can just explain why you have how you helped the basically your community members to fix the particular bug which you encountered during the hackathon uh, basically you can just share how successfully you built that project now here after that you can see once you have explained both these things now here you have to click on i agree and then click on simply submit okay now once you have click on i agree and then once you have click on submit then your submission will be submitted and once eligible you will be contacted by i think before april you will be contacted and I will make a detailed video regarding it so basically this is the simple step how you have to become a facilitator make sure to hurry up and fill the form because as early as you fill the form the chances of getting selected is maximum basically in previous cohort many of the new facilitators were also selected but some were not selected so you can try your luck and if you want to just basically try your luck and just try to complete it and make sure to hype the video and this important thing i will share all the links in the description box of this video and this is the quick thing i wanted to share if you have any doubts any queries you can let me in the comment section thank you guys have a great day ahead